Action. You direct your friend, Oprah Winfrey. Yeah. What's that moment like? Hey, listen, it was really cool, but Oprah's not kind of a, she's not a hello kind of girl. No. So we had well, fun. She, liked, she, she loves my dear. Oh, she loves it. She loves it, <laughs> but she, 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 she don't want to play her sister. Hello. So I had to find the right thing for yeah. her, and I'm sitting there, and I'm directing Oprah and Susan Sarandon and Sam Watterson and Dean Norris all in the same scene going, boy, sh made it. So that's, it took that for me to know. That's a wrap. Only E.T. can take you to the Atlanta set of Tyler Perry's new film. Obviously, I've known Ms. Winfrey yeah. for a very long time. I know she came here to act, to just get in the trenches, <laughs> and she was so good. People tried the Women's Army Corps. You mean the White Women's Army Corps? Oprah plays a civil rights leader. Kerry Washington, well, she's doing double duty, starring in and executive producing The Six Triple Eight, out December 20th on Netflix. It's inspired by the first and only Women's Army Corps unit of color to serve overseas in World War II. And we will not fail! You called this role the privilege of a lifetime? Mm -hmm. This story is so important because it's untold history. I mean, the mission that these women were sent on was to sort through 17 million pieces of mail. They brought people together for three years. There was no communication between wives and husbands and fathers and children. They bridged that gap. Every single one of us matters, and this is such an extraordinary example of that.